Hi, it's Molly from Sacred Fire Creative, and today I'm doing a video on how to add and edit your blog posts. And I'm using WordPress here on a website for Dr. Gwen O'Keefe. I've gotten her permission, and so now we're starting at the dashboard. So when you first log into WordPress, this is going to be the first screen that you come across. And so to get to the blog posts, there are different ways, but what I'm going to do is on the left-hand side here, I'm going to hover over posts, and I'm going to choose all posts. And then when I do that, I'm going to get a list of all the posts that are written so far. And I'm going to start with editing one of these posts. So I'm going to hover over the title. I'm going to click edit. Now it's going to bring up this post. If you need to edit the title, you can do that here. If you want to edit the permalink, you can edit that here. And we're going to just keep those the same. And you'll see that the text for the article is right here. On the right hand side, I want to point out the different categories. So if you need to add a new category, you can do that here. You can also add tags. And these are searchable tags within WordPress, so you'll want to add a few of those. So what I did was I added tags based on the words that were most used in the article. The other thing that you'll notice is this featured image. So if I want to change that featured image, I can go ahead and click that. And then the other area that I want to point out to you is this Yoast SEO, which is Search Engine Optimization. And so you want to be sure and edit this for every blog article. So the first area that we come across is this snippet preview. So this would be like, for example, what would come up in a Google search. And you'll see the title, the URL, and then the description. So I notice, first of all, that my description gets kind of cut off. So I'm going to go ahead and edit that. And I'm going to go ahead and just shorten it. And you'll notice this bar that's orange turns green. And so that's what we want to see in Yoast. It really likes that green light. Green light means go, and so that means we're doing a good job. I chose a keyword of precision medicine. So you can change your keyword here depending on the article. The analysis area down below gives you some information on what you can do to improve your SEO. So it says the images on this page do not have alt attributes containing the focus keyword. So in that case, I'm going to go ahead and change that so that my image has the same description as the title. So I'm going to go ahead and click on that featured image. And here's where I can change it. I'm going to change the title. And just for, for ease, I'm going to go ahead and change the alt text and the description. I'm going to click set featured image. And you notice that it's changed. To, to green. There are some other things here that you can also play with and these are just the most important. You may want to change the readability, take a look at that if you like. And you want to click update to save all the changes. All right. And so that is pretty much it. If I want to add a new post, I can click Add New. And 
And again, you just start here with the title. You can add your text right here in the box below that. You want to be sure and click the categories. Add your tags. Set your featured image. If you need to upload files, it's right here on the left. So you probably want to use a new image. And then you can edit your snippet, your focus keyword, the readability in this area. You can also set this to schedule when it's published. So you can edit this, change the date and time, click OK, and then hit publish. If you change the date to a future date, it will say schedule. And then it'll just schedule that for you in the future. And that is, in a nutshell, what you need to know to add and edit your blog posts. All right, thanks a lot for watching.